SUV, the unmistakably 80s LMO02, was a military review animal fueled by a shouting V12 motor. While it appeared to be totally odd at the time, it ended up being far-sighted given the present consistently growing cluster of ultra-extravagance, superior SUVs from any semblance of Bentley, Mercedes-Benz, Porsche, Maserati, and, soon, Ferrari and Aston Martin. So there's no time like the present for Lamborghini to bounce once again into the shred with the 2019 Yaris. The organization's second historically speaking SUV is over the best, as well, yet for totally unexpected reasons in comparison to the LMO2. The Urus, which gets its name from an old types of steers, paralyzes with its 641 pole, its emotional wedge-formed outline, and its desire to be as proficient around a circuit as it is on the sand ridges. In the engine is the principal turbocharged motor ever to be introduced in a generation Lamborghini, and the primary V8 in numerous decades. It shares its 4.0-liter dislodging and twin turbochargers with the V8 introduced in numerous other Volkswagen Group items, yet Lamborghini demands that the outline is its own, a claim enlarged by the V8's unmistakable sound. Yield sits at 641 pull and 627 pounds to foot of torque, each number second among brand issues just to the firmly bring down lease, 707 horsepower Jeep Grand Cherokee Trackhawk. The Urus additionally will in the long run make a big appearance Lamborghini's first half and half drive train, in spite of the fact that we don't yet know any insights about the gas electric model. Typically, the inside adopts a frame above work strategy, with various intriguing calfskin, wood, carbon fiber, and metal trim alternatives accessible. Screens are all over, including a huge computerized check group, a genuinely traditional looking focal infotainment show, and a lower control touch screen that is reminiscent of the unit in Range Rover's new Wheeler. Sitting inside the Urus, we observe back seat space to be sufficient, in spite of the fact that headroom is somewhat squeezed by the slanted roofline. Both four and five situate setups are accessible, while the roofline and the pointedly raked lift gate imply that the load territory is profound yet not tall. When it goes at a bargain in the United States late one year from now, the Urus will impart space to the Hurricane at the section level end of the Lamborghini lineup, as it will begin at generally an indistinguishable $200,000 from that V10 Super Cup. An immense extension of Lamborghini's processing plant in its main residence of Santa Gattabola Nice, Italy, as of now has been finished to construct the Urus, as the organization hopes to extensively build its yearly generation yield with the SUV's expansion to its portfolio. All things considered, among extravagance brands, super SUVs are extremely popular right now, and this Italian is turning out to be a standout amongst the most super of all. Super of all.